Hello friends, today we are going to solve CBSC class 9th exercise 8.1 question number 12. ABCD is a trapezium in which AB parallel to CD. Look here, ABCD is a trapezium in which AB parallel to CD and AD is equal to BC. Means they had given this AB is equal to BC. Show that angle A is equal to angle B means we have to prove this angle A is equal to angle B angle C is equal to angle D triangle ABC means we have to join that we will do later and then we have to prove these two triangles are congruent then we have to prove that AC is equal to BD and again they had given a hint always read the question properly first then start to solve this they had told us extend AB and draw a line through C parallel to DA intersecting AB at E means we have to extend AB and draw a line we had, ex we had extended this and then we had drawn a line through C parallel to AD so we had drawn a line parallel to AD here and that both were intersecting at point E so here we got AECD a parallelogram because these were parallel they had given us and we had constructed this parallel so if both the lines both the pair of opposite sides are parallel then it forms a parallelogram so for solution first you have to write construction construct as they had written here that only you have to write then what you will get there then by construction you can say quadrilateral a e c d is a parallelogram but first we have to write this construction they had written that you have to do it then from that construction we can say e c d is a parallelogram now first thing we have to prove that angle a is equal to angle b so for proving that we need these angles so here it is a parallelogram so we know the sum of these two angles will be 180 Mm, but we want to prove this okay let it now they had given these two equal and it is a parallelogram here quadrilateral a e c d is a parallelogram so can i write a b a d is equal to e c opposite sides of a parallelogram are equal and they had given a d equals to b c given so this equals to this and this equal to this also so from these two therefore you can if you want to give you can give result also from one and two from one and two we get we get bc is equal to c now you got these two sides are equal so what can you say about these two that two angles will be also equal so now in triangle B B C E we had proved B C is equal to C E therefore angle C B E is equal to angle C E B equal angles of equal opposite sides now these two angles are equal suppose this is x x you can write suppose angle c b e is equal to angle c e b is equal to x now we got this two x okay now the sum of these two i'm writing here sorry i, I think we should start from sum of these two is 180 so can I write angle A plus angle E is equal to 180 degree adjacent angles of a parallelogram make a sum of 180 degree so can I write Ang angle A plus X is equal to 180 degree angle A is equal to 180 minus X result number 1 now again we know the sum of these two will be 
means angle B plus X also equals to 180 degree. Why? Linear pair of angle. Linear pair of angles. So here we got now take that X on angle B is equal to 180 minus X. Result number 2 or you had given 1 and 2 so you if you want to give you can give 3 and 4 also from again from this 1 and 2 or 3 and 4 we get what we get answer of a is also 180 minus x b is also 180 minus x so angle a is equal to angle b answer number 1 now we want to prove c is equal to d so again here only i can prove this x so this will be also x y angle E is equal to angle D. Opposite angles of a parallelogram are equal. Take it as result number 3. Now this X, so this also X. Angle, uh, you, if you want to write C, E, E, C, E, B, C equals to angle B, C, D. Why? Alternate interior angles so these two are also equal this or x this also x so what we can say angle c also equals to angle x that is result number four here also e c that is x so these two are x so from three and four from three and four again we got that E also X, C also, uh, sorry, D also X, C also X. So angle C is equal to angle D. This is our answer number 2. Now we want to prove these two triangles are congruent. Look here. So first we have to join this. A, B, C. And then B, A, D. We want the triangle from the upper part. Again, I am drawing it here so that you can mm, see it properly. It's A, B, C and it's B, A, D. We want to make these two triangles congruent. So can I? I am writing in triangle A, B, C and triangle a B D A B equals to A B these two are equal why A B equals to A B common same now we had proved that uh, this A equals to this B angle A equals to angle B proved above in our answer number only on answer number one only we had proved this now the third thing that we have to prove uh, that is given only that BD BC is equal to AD that is given BC is equal to AD given therefore what we can say triangle ABC congruent to triangle BAD by side angle side rule this is our answer number third but we want fourth also that is AC what can you say about AC and BD so we can easily say that AC also equals to BD by CPCT corresponding parts of congruent triangle so here this congruent so this way we can solve this sum thank you so much for watching my video if you like it please subscribe to my channel Thank you.